How's it going, saxophones? As you can already see, I have my saxophone tire right here, ready to go. And so, before we start playing hot cross buns, we're going to go ahead and make sure that we're saying, still getting a good sound and setting our armature first, okay? So, uh, we're going to do a quick little warm up with our neck, and then we're going to go ahead and jump in into the instrument. So, a reminder to make sure that you set your mouthpiece correctly, okay? If you have any chips or anything like that on your reed, that reed is no good anymore. So you want, want to make sure that you have a fresh set of new reeds just in case something like that does happen, okay? So go ahead and check back to that video that I posted before on how to set up your saxophone. It gave a really great resource as to how to set your armature and also how to set up your mouthpiece as well, okay? Once you have those things ready to go, go ahead and have make sure that it's fully attached with your neck. And we're going to go ahead and just create a sound with just our mouthpiece and our neck of our saxophone. So we're going to go ahead and breathe in for four and we're going to go ahead and play out and hold our note for four beats long, okay? So here we go. Now on with your set. So breathe in for four beats. Here we go. And one, two, three, four. Breathe in. Two, three, then play. Breathe in, two, three, play. Breathe in, two, three, play. Breathe in, two, three, play. And then stop. Good, guys. Once you're able to get a nice clear sound through it without shaking is happening in between, nice and steady, go ahead and connect your neck back with your instrument. Now just be very careful guys when you place it back inside the instrument. A lot of you guys have um, this little part right here. This is the little lever that controls the octave thumb key right here in the back, okay? So make sure you're not pressing this key when you're bringing the, the neck in so that way it doesn't damage it and then cause the instrument to not play. So carefully slide it in. Once it's slid in nice and straight, I'm going to go ahead and tighten up the screw right here that holds the neck in place with the instrument. So I'm going to go ahead and tighten it, not super tight, just make sure it's nice and firm. And once it's tight, do not move the neck. It does damage the instrument if you try moving the neck while this is tight. If you need to move it for whatever reason, loosen it up and then you'll be good to go. Alright, so now my instrument is set. I'm going to go ahead and put my neck strap. You want to make sure that you adjust your neck strap at your height. That means that when you go from rest position to playing position, it should be right in your mouth, directly straight. If you have to lower down your neck or raise it up or raise up the instrument at all, then you want to make sure you adjust it either higher or lower so it's perfect for your height. So I'm going to adjust mine just a little bit higher and that's perfect for my height, okay? Alright, so we're going to go ahead and take a look at our first five notes of the saxophone, okay? So our first note is going to be G. It's going to be one, two, three. That's G. Our next note is going to be A, which is this two right here, A. After A, it's going to be B, which is the first one right here. And after B, it's going to be C, just the second one right here. And after C, it's going to be D, and that's going to be one, two, three, thumb key back here. And then in the bottom of the saxophone, it's going to be one, two, three. And that's it. Okay? Pinky's just hanging out right there, not touching anything. All right, so what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to play each note for one quarter note, for one beat long. We're going to play them three times each. So three Gs, followed by a rest. Three As, followed by a rest. Three Bs, followed by a rest. Three Cs, followed by a rest. Three Ds. Followed by a rest, and then we're going to go back down in reverse order, okay? So I have our music right here, so that way you can follow along. And then, out oh, here we go. I'm going to have my metronome, so we keep a nice steady beat. We're going to play through that whole warm-up sequence, all right? One, two, three.
you want to, Ethan? Do you wanna go ahead and try doing that? A couple of times to make sure that you're nice and ready and you're not feeling tired, okay? That's the one thing. Alright guys, once you're done with that, go ahead and move on to our song. Good job.